We want you guys to be able to get all the tips and tricks, the trade secrets. A lot of y'all been asking me, where is the panty? What's up with the Panamera? I need to bring this car on the channel more. Sometimes I forget about this damn car, it's so nice. Uh, and I took the wheels off because at the time I had got into performance. So I wanted to get the best times possible. Yo, Mod Squad, what's goody? What's going on, y'all, man? Y'all know, y'all know, y'all know that I've been talking about a major announcement that's coming, man. Something that I needed y'all to save the date for. Something that was super duper important. Well, today is the day that I could finally say what it is, what's going on, and what I've been holding out on, man. Today is the day that you hear about for the first time, the event that I've been telling y'all, November 12th through the 14th. What I'm about to show y'all is beautiful. Like, I really put my heart and my soul. Stunner, Reese really put his heart and his soul. Demonology is directing us over the phone. Like, we really put all of this into this shoot right here just to make this very important announcement. And y'all been patient, patiently waiting. So I'm not going to delay no more. Right now, turn your speakers up, turn it to big screen, full screen mode, whatever it is you gotta do. If you wanna turn it on on the TV, or whatever it is, stop what you're doing, pay full attention, and watch this promo for the Creator Connection Retreat. In three, two, one. It is going down 100%. We are doing the first of our YouTubers retreat, a retreat specifically for YouTubers. You know, those of you who are looking to grow a channel, start a channel, or just meet the people that of the videos that you watch, you can do all of that. All of that is available, man. It's, it's going to be so dope. We're going to take a whole weekend, recharge our batteries in terms of us YouTubers, and give back to all of you. We want you guys to be able to get all the tips and tricks, the trade secrets, the how tools. You know, we're going to have different topics from how to monetize your YouTube channel, how to grow your YouTube channel, and more and more and more and the best thing about what we're doing is because it's in Myrtle Beach South Carolina at a resort you can feel comfortable putting in your vacation time from work and using this as your vacation because you're gonna have fun in the Sun and you're gonna learn man and that's Veterans Day weekend so if anybody asks you what you're doing this year for Veterans Day weekend guess what you're telling them you're going to Myrtle Beach South Carolina to the creator connection retreat so that you could learn 
educate yourself and grow all the above all in one weekend now we haven't started announcing the youtubers that we're gonna have there but we're gonna have big youtubers some of the ones that are your favorites outside of of course mod fame is your number one favorite but some of your other favorites you'll be able to go see kick it with learn from listen to them pour out their heart and soul to you guys and all the information that they have in their heads that you could get there's no amount of money that you could pay a collaboration that's going to help you as much as this there's no amount of money that you can pay to watch online videos there's nothing that you can do that's going to give you this same experience as being in the same room with youtube success if you want success on youtube so right now do yourselves a favor visit creatorcon.com that's creator c-o-n-n -N, two n's creatorcon.com get all the details because ticket sales although they haven't gone live just yet they will soon and you're going to want to get yours because it's very limited we're only having a limited number of people because we want to give everybody a good value we don't want thousands of people where we can't connect one-on-one -on -one, you know what i mean so right now Go to creatorcon.com, get all the details. The the hotel you saw it, bro, the resort where we stay, you just saw it in that promo. Fire. That joint is on the beach. Indoor pools, indoor water slides, restaurants, bars, everything all in there together. So you know that whole weekend. Now we gonna learn. We gonna learn. But we gonna have some fun too, bro. We gonna have some fun. So don't miss the turn up. Creatorcon.com. Visit there now, man. But you guys are asking yourself, well, Stefan, what you doing, man? What you doing in Durango? Where you going? A lot of y'all been asking me, where is the panty? What's up with the Panamera? I've been seeing it. And I'm like, yo, they right, bro. I don't show that car no love on the channel. Now, I, I periodically go driving and stuff like that. But I usually don't put it on the channel. Sometimes I put it on my Instagram. If you don't follow me on Instagram, that's simple, at mod fame. You know what I'm saying? It's easy. You go to at mod fame on Instagram you'll see some early sneak peeks and stuff too so if you want the inside track to a lot of information and if you true mod squad make sure that you hit up the insta and follow there i mean that was that was man i'm so excited but today right now man it's a beautiful day so heading out in the rango um going to get the panamera we need to clean that car up that car needs a good detail i haven't like really put my hands on it and washed it by myself for a minute so that's therapy for me i don't know about y'all but washing my own car is therapeutic i don't know what it is about it but it takes me away from the world it takes me away from all my my concerns and cares and i could just focus on wax on wax off you hear me mr miyagi <laughs> so right now i'm going to go get the panamera i'll meet y'all over there man i'll see y'all in a couple seconds yeah buddy after a quick drive y'all just saw that I was in the Durango chilling. What magically appears? None other than that thing. Y'all remember this thing, man. That's right. Panamera Turbo. Still out here, man. We still here. Car still looking absolutely gorgeous. Car still looking absolutely clean as hell. Amazing as ever. I need to bring this car on the channel more. You, I, what I used to do is whenever it was cold outside and I didn't want to take out the Hellcat, I will bring this out because it got all wheel drive. It is a turbo. Um, it is DME tuned, down pipes, BMC filter, IPD plenum. Uh, car runs a consistent 11.2 quarter mile, 11.3, 11.2 at about 122 mile an hour. So it's a very, very, very quick car and it does its thing and it's still absolutely, I mean, look at the interior, bro. Look at the interior on this thing. It is still absolutely gorgeous. I mean, sometimes I forget about this damn car. It's so nice, you know what I'm saying? I just like to keep it that way. I like to keep it nice and pretty, icy clean. Down to the engine itself. Down to the engine itself is icy clean. Oh, look at this out of place. Put that back in place. Get back in there, there you go. Okay, cool, there we go. Look at that, down to that, everything. Everything super icy nicey, bro. So I was telling them, D, I, I forget sometimes how nice this damn car is, cause I, cause I never, I never bring it out no more. But <laughs> it really is, man. It's just a, it's a pretty car. 
And that, that's not even with the wheels on. I had took the shoes off. I had 22s on here and I took the wheels off because at the time I had got into performance. So I wanted to get the best times possible. And it did make a difference taking the 22s off and putting the 20s back on with the Toyo 888R tires in the back on the stock 20. Now the crazy part is a lot of people don't realize this car comes with 20 by nine and a half in the front and 20 by 11s in the back. So it's already really wide in the back. Those are 305, 35, 20s in the back. The same that I use on a Hellcat. These tires actually did come off my Hellcat. So that's why I have so much experience with different tires on the Hellcat because I've had them all. But man, bruh, come on, man. Come on, man. This thing is beautiful. It's beautiful, the damn car, man. So icy. Sheesh. All right, all right. I'm, I'm gonna stop fronting and start driving this car some more. I'm gonna start, stop fronting on it. But like I said, yeah. This is the only mod you could really see, the IPD plenum. Everything else is hidden. The down pipes you can't see. The tune, obviously, you can't see. The filter is behind the bumper. So you're not gonna see none of that stuff. But, man, listen. Here we go. Whew. Yo, mod to fame. Listen, man. I always try to keep it together, even on hot days. I gotta keep it all together, man. So I got the Mod Fame standard T on right now. Got that Mod Fame dye hat in red, cause you know you gotta keep the, you know what I mean? You gotta keep it together. Anyway, listen, man, make sure you guys support your favorite YouTuber by being part of the Mod Squad. Visit ModToFame.com, get your tees, get your hats, get your decals, like what's on the bottom of the Porsche. Anyway, yo, I appreciate y'all, much love. Back to the video. times how nice this damn car is man such a luxury car man. i know a lot of y'all want to know yo steph we don't have the penny for a minute what we doing and uh hey man i'm waiting i'm waiting out my time y'all i'm waiting out the time because right now car prices are just absolutely bananas bro car prices are bananas so you know i paid i paid well over what i should have paid for that dodge charger but it was what was necessary at the time you feel um it's just it's just part for the cost but when you pay over on a car that's not that expensive that's not bad but to be honest with you and truthful with y'all what i want to do is when this car goes away when this car goes away i know i make fun of all the time and talk about them all the time supercars right but when this let's make sure i wasn't no cop when this car goes away it's going to be replaced by some sort of supercar. So I'm just holding on to it, man. You know, keeping the mileage low, keeping the condition pristine because I believe that these cars have bottomed out in the market right now. So this one is a 2011 turbo with 57,000 miles. So right now the market is calling for these cars in the condition that mine is in, I could probably get about 55 for this car. Uh, 50 to 55, I would say, um, given the condition of this car, how pristine and clean it is. I believe that's the bottom of the market, though. Like, they ain't gonna go past that. They had dipped down into the high 40s for a little bit, but now they're back up. And my assumption is that that trend is probably gonna stay where it is or continue around there. So I know that I got 45 to 50 grand sitting, waiting for when I'm ready. And when the market corrects itself, I'll be ready. And I don't know what supercar I would replace it with or get, but I need a supercar next to the supercar Slayer. I need them parked next to each other. I just think it would be so much fun to troll people and be like, yo, I'll kill you with my supercar Slayer. They'd be like, yeah, that's cause you can't afford a supercar. And I'll be like, 
whoop, whoop. You mean that one right next to it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's mine too. Hey, hey, yo, boss car. That'd be dope, right? So I gotta get that set up, man. I gotta get that done. And uh, I think that these high prices on cars are around at least for another eight months, I'd say. So by sometime next year, I think things should come back down to reality. And once things come back down to reality, the panty gonna go bye-bye. We're gonna go bye-bye in the panty, bro. Great car. And one thing I also forget is how quick this damn car is. This car is quick. When that boost roll in, it, this car rolls out, bro. It really roll out, man. I forget how quick this damn car is. Anyway, man, let me get on back to the crib, get this thing parked up. I'm gonna probably, uh, I'm gonna park it. Uh, I only got a one-car garage, so, hey, this one gonna be outside. <laughs> it is what it is. But uh, let me get on to the crib, man. I'm hungry anyway. I gotta call wifey and see if she wants something to eat. Continue on with my day. But I hope y'all like them cinematics so far. Your boy been practicing with the drone. How he looking? How he looking? Low, low rough, low rough, low rough. But we'll get there. We we'll make it. We'll, we'll get there better and better. Just a little practice. And I know y'all missed the Panamera, so I just pulled it out for y'all. Honestly, I ain't really had no reason to drive this damn car. But figured I'd wash it up, clean it, uh, keep it nice, and hold on to it for a few days before I put it away again. So it'll be on the channel in the next couple videos. So for those of you Porsche Panamera Turbo lovers or Porsche lovers, I got y'all, at least for the next couple videos. But uh, see y'all at the crib. And just like that, your boy is home, safe and sound. Got the panty, and then you see the supercar slayer back there. That's it, man. One, hey, 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 one car garage life problems. But either way, man, it's all good. We, we make do with what we have, and we make it happen, you understand me? But anyway, I appreciate y'all rocking out with me for another video. I hope you guys are as excited as I am about Creator Connection Retreat. This retreat is going to be freaking awesome. It's going to be off the hook. And just think about taking a whole weekend and doing nothing but what you want to do, which is grow, start, or be around YouTube. YouTubers, to be specific, man. But I'm about to go right now and play with the little boy on the red wagon. That's my lady and little man. I'm about to go play with them and stop messing with y'all. But I hope y'all like the video. Visit modfaint.com to continue to support. And until the next one, man, I don't know what day this is, but the next video is either gonna be dropping Monday, Wednesday, or Saturday. But that's my commitment to you guys. Only thing that I ask is that you come back and watch on those days. All right, rock with your boy, Mod Squad. Appreciate you. It's your boy, Stefan here from Mod Fame. And uh, closing out with this beauty, which I think we're going to take to go get dinner right now as a family. We out. We out.